from the Old Testament Book of Ruth, chapter 3, a portion of verse 11. All my fellow townsmen know that you are a woman of noble character. Sarah Bass Allen has known as this in her day and time. Like Flora, Sarah was from a colony of Virginia and born into slavery, but her location of birth is known. The Isle of Wight. Let's clarify that. Isle of Wight is a place on the map of Virginia and not an island. It is known as Sarah Bass that by the age of eight was living in the colonial Philadelphia. By the year 1800, she was no longer a slave. Little is known of Sarah's early life. Some information states that she was a widow. However, there is some information that she too helped in caring of the sick through the yellow fever epidemic of 1793. Somewhere in between 1793 and 1800, Sarah met with Reverend Richard Allen. I believe they did in the Cedar Ward because that is the section of Old Philadelphia that's where many blacks live. See the war is like where Mount Albert Montebello is. Recorded in the registry from St. George Church, where Richard Allen and Sarah were married August the 17th, 1801, by Reverend Cooper. First Lady Sarah Allen saw a blacksmith shop replaced the brick by the brick by the brick church in 1805 as Bethel membership continued to grow. The Bethel Church in the Allen home was a haven for runaway slaves and was part of the underground railroad. I have to also say now Pistol was too. First lady Sarah Allen handled her responsibilities with race and dexterity. Sarah Allen's girl was a busy one. She managed a household, finances, raised six children, Richard Jr., James, John, Peter, Sarah, and Anne, plus a seven child, Joseph Lee Jr., the son of the evangelist General Lee. The life of General Lee is another interesting part of the women's history of the AME Church. Mother Sarah established her fundamental duties in being the first lady of the early church. In 1827, the Dork Society was, a step, was founded by Mother Sarah Allen. The ladies aided the male ministers by feeding and caring for the general clothing needs, as the early traveling ministers received little if any financial aid in the performance of their duty. The Dirty Society is now the present-day Women's Missionary Society. While sitting in his record chair by the window of his home, one for East Blue Street, Bishop Richard Allen dies, Saturday, March 26, 1831. He is buried at the Bethel Burial Ground. The life of Sarah Allen has been changed, but she is still revered and respected by all. Mother Sarah Allen continued to be a slower but still a productive life until the age of 89. She dies at the home of her youngest child, Ann Adams, on July 16, 1849. She joins the Bishop of at the Bethel Burial Ground. Both her bodies are reinterred in 1901 in the spiritually fitting ceremony in and then two of their fourth level AME church edifice. The first, first baby, Flora Allen's body, was reinterred to Eden Cemetery, where other distinguished African Americans 